So the first one is dictation nation. Okay. Remember, I think of all these little automations as um, little robots that are here to help you out. And dictation nation means you can double the speed, accuracy, and clarity of the messages that you send on your smartphone. It requires about five to 10 practice emails to be created, and then you will have it down. It's second nature. I don't even have to think about it anymore. You want to, of course, say your punctuation. And then you want to say this following phrase. Just say it with me right now. New paragraph, dash, dash. Yep, new paragraph, dash, dash. And I'm actually going to have you turn on your dictation and open up an email, and I'll try to have me dictate into your phone. It might get a little garbled. It's a little tricky to do, but let's try it right now. Because I want you to see it to print out on your phone, just to know that it's the reality of how well this is. So open up an email, and I'm going to sort of do a three, two, one, and that's when I want you to tap the dictation button right there, okay? So, so don't do it yet. Let me get ready. Three, two, one. Hi, Joan, exclamation point, new paragraph. Request, colon, please send me your feedback on today's Outlook smartphone apps program, period. New paragraph, dash, dash. What an amazing audience, comma, and I'm not just saying that because they're watching me dictate this email, period. Smiley face. New paragraph, dash, dash. Seriously, though, comma, let me know if there's anything that we can improve for future sessions or any ideas that you had about how we can go even farther with this great program, period. New paragraph, dash, dash. Always grateful and psyched to work with you and your team. Exclamation point. And now I turned it off. So hopefully you were able to see me dictating into your phone. But let's take a quick peek at how well this was. Well, it didn't get Joan's name right, which is really a bummer, Joan. But let's use that as an opportunity to show how cool the editing features are when you press and hold the space bar to do that. So I just do a quick tap up in that area, and I long hold the, the, the space bar, and see how it's moving around now? So now I can just edit this email by dropping it in there. So I just long pressed and hold, and I sort of fished around. Long pressed and hold, notice the keyboard disappeared. And this becomes a sort of a navigational tool. It's a little kludgy when it's on the very top line, but you can see you can surgically get it in there really well. Now I'm going to go back a couple spaces, get that right. The rest of it looks 99% great. Now, is this as good as an official bullet point? No, but are bullet points completely missing from the, the, the uh, digital efficiency game for most people? Yes, they are. They just give up on bullet points and send wall of words messages. But what if yours are crisp and clear like this, even if you're sending them from a smartphone? And people don't like to read wall of words messages. They love bullet pointed copy. So just know that this bullet point stuff, it's very popular with the most important person in a communication, the recipient, <laughs> the recipient of your communication. 